everything seems impossible until it happens. Two weeks ago, Federal Labor was saying that there was no more money in the budget to deliver for public and social housing. Today, the Prime Minister announces $2 billion. Five years ago, the New South Wales Labor Party said there's no way they could end no grounds evictions. At the end of last year, they made a commitment to deliver on it if they form government and it will happen by the end of the year. We know that there was no chance to be able to see that there would ever be a future where we got rid of the Liberal National Government's agenda when it comes to the demolition of public housing homes. Just because the Minister says today she's planning to go ahead does not mean that it cannot be stopped. Because we together collectively are winning this struggle to make sure we protect public housing in our city and we are committed to the idea of freezing rents to stopping the sell-off and demolition of public housing and making sure that we are seeing real money invested in the delivery of more public housing into the future because there is no excuse for anyone to be sleeping in a car or a tent when we are a wealthy country and we are delivering billions of dollars in tax concessions to the uber wealthy. Thank you very much. I'm Jenny Leong. It's wonderful being here. Solidarity with you all. Tax, 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 tax,